morning folks, hope you're all well. It's a crisp old morning here, up in North Cornwall, and we're going to do a little circular walk for you, uh, from North Mouth here, which is just outside Bude, north of Bude. We're going to go inland through the fields and valleys, and the woods, up to Duckpool, and back by the coast. And I'm also going to show you a couple of little gypsy park ups as well. So get your boots on, and come with us. Happy days! This is where you walk up inland towards Duckpill, folks. This is the caravan in season. Crack a little tea room, that is. Or a tea caravan. <laughs> nice Cornish flag flying away there in the October sunshine. There's Scruffy. It's closed, I think, Scruff. Come on. <laughs> Always nosing, isn't he? <laughs> anyway, on up the track here. There you go, teas. Cracking. There he is, our Scruffy. Okay, folks, if you like your camping in its simplest form, this is the place to come. This is Dunsmouth Farm, just north of Northcote. It's a mouthful, isn't it? <laughs> anyway, you come up the track we just walked up in your, in your car, your van, and uh, you won't find this little camp on any internet search engine anywhere. Dunsmouth Farm. I'll just show you the facilities. Here we go. Nice little single lovey. And this is your shower. This is your washing facilities. Pallet and... Nice cold tap there, and there's a hose on there in the summer, and you can have your morning shower under that. I just say it's a couple of quid a night here, and it's it's a fab little spot. The sunsets you get up here are unbelievable. I'll just go and show you some of the views now. Scruffy chasing something. Okay, folks, that's uh, looking back down there the way. We just come up the bridle way there. You can see really clearly marked out. You can't go far wrong. That's back down towards Northcote and Bude there in the early morning haze. And so you just come up here and follow it right round there. You see where it goes. You got across the road there that goes from Stib to Sandymouth, and then you go over the fields there, and that'll take us up to the top of Duckpool, where we go down through the woods. Cracking. Well, as you can see, Scruffy has had his usual role in something, and he's minging. Bless him. <laughs> well, folks, hope you enjoyed this morning's little wander with us. Nice little trek with us up in North Cornwall. This is Duckpool down here in the valley, and that's the satellite station there just before Mormonstow. And we're just coming down the bridleway here. This is Stowe Barton Farm over here. we got to go on the road for a minute or two, so we'll put the boy in the lead, and then we're going to go down to them woods to Duckpool. Right, so let's crack on for there. It's a fine morning here. Folks, we just come down through the woods there, and this is looking down in the Coombe Valley. That's Duckpool down there, and that's our next little gypsy camp we're going to show you. Little gypsy park up. To get here, if you were to drive in, you'd come down the road from Kilcampton on the A39, turn off there, just north of Bude, and you come down here, over that little bridge, till you see this little sign. Oh, little van like mine. <laughs> there you go, Duckpool. Then you turn down here. Right, let's go and have a look at it. Right, just arriving now down in Duckpool. There's the little toilets over there, nice basic. Little lobbies if you need them. And uh, in the few years we've been doing these films, <laughs> we've never been recognised as Bo Drifty and Scruffy. A few folk have said, oh, it's that Belfast busker and his dog. But uh, odd socks are from Devon. Up in Dartmoor there, she's been having a little gypsy night down here. And she just pulled away in the van and pulled over and said, Oh, it's Bo Drifty and Scruffy. <laughs> so there you go. It's a real little park up if you want a bit of peace and quiet. There's no signal down here for anything. So this is the place to come if you want to just come and chill out and relax. And uh, that's the coast path there. That winds up towards them satellite dishes and round the Hawker's Hut in Warrenstow. I've got that in a, a video, so I'll put that in the description box for you. But a uh, great little park up this is. The sound of them waves. And... Uh, about five, five kilometres, three miles inland that was. 
and that's the coast path there that'll take us back to Northcote. I've got that. Better walk in a bit more detail. So I'll put that in the description as well. I'll do a few shots on the way back in a minute. But let's have a little look around here, look. Great place to come down. Park up, plenty of room. And then the lobbies. I'm not sure if they're open all year or not. I don't know. But uh, they're there anyway. And uh, plenty of room, as I say. Just to sit, enjoy the views. Right, we're just going to have a brew up and I head back to Northgate. Oh, who's a nice and clean puppy? Who's a nice and clean puppy? He's found the ball and he's in a bath in this lovely little stream here. He was minging, by the way. Right, we're going to go up that nice climb there. Alright, Scruff, enjoying your walkies. Okay, folks, back on the coast now. This is a. Uh, that took us uh, up from down from Duckpool, and we're now in the Warren Gutter. The nicest looking gutter I've ever been in, and I've been in a few of those over the years, trust me. <laughs> what a place, eh? And we're just going to head up back towards Sandy Mouth and Northgate. Beautiful. Here we are at Sandy Mouth Bay, folks. Just come down that valley there. And uh, if you catch the tide right here, and it's fairly out, you can get right back to Northcote along the beach there. And maybe pick up some driftwood if you're lucky enough to find any. But we're gonna, the tide's coming in now, so we're gonna stick to the cliff tops. But look at that, eh? Come on, you! Tinker. Don't have to get close, you know. Beautiful. Surfer out there as well, enjoying the waves. Listen to that. Just perfect. Okay, folks, we're back where we started this morning. We're back at Northcote Mouth, and I hope you enjoyed the little trek with us today. Bit of everything in that walk, wasn't there? Fields, hills, valleys, woodland, sea, and that lovely coastline, of course, at the end. And we'll see you all again on the next adventure. But until then, keep smiling and enjoy your day. Happy days from North Cornwall.